hide this tutorial just uh, to remember and to tell you guys that something things go wrong I was filming with simple screen recorder which is up here and I was then um, changing my tin 2 panel and this icon was gone I couldn't stop it anymore then I went to look for YouTube and said what was the shortcut again and yes it was Control R to pause the program but I could not really stop it I could not really save it so the only thing I had to do or could do was uh, log off and that doesn't help didn't help so simple screen recorder just kept working so I had to shut down and then we had this kind of file we had a file that was not working anymore was not could not be opened was an error so it, it was never um, closed so there was a missing piece inside I think it was com called atom or something some part of the the movie which is uh, behind very at the end it was missing I thought well that's a challenge let's figure that out so I went to look and I want to tell you guys that this is a very interesting thing so untrunk is the thing I did first I believe and we're working on Arch Labs, Arch Linux, so we have this Arch package, so I installed Untrunk. And then, um, basically, what did I do? I did try, yeah, I had to make an, another working video, so I quickly recorded with some simple screen recorder. I quickly recorded 5-2 minutes, of, of even 10 seconds. So I had a good one and a broken one. So I gave him, this is my working, MP4, that's how it's named here, and I gave him the broken one. And yes, it worked. So then I had this uh, video fixed, how do they call it? I think it's this one, video MP4 fixed, that came out of trunk. But then of course, um, I was happy, so everything works sound works yeah so super but of course at some point in time after 3 minutes 44 seconds or was it longer anyway I was stuck and all this jibber jabber at the end had to be cut so I went to look for other websites where I could uh, find out how to do cut and the cutting part is I think somewhere here so I did that with F, F, let's maybe go just one up. Huh? This is the code I used. So FFmpeg starting at 0 seconds, stopping at 33 minutes, 40 seconds. And that's my file that was the input file. At some point I had this test file. Uh, oh yeah, the test file is a different story. Um, I could not do that. I could not try to do this with this program because well red errors now if that's still open in any terminal anyway I got problems so I couldn't do that then I think it's this kind of problem that was happening so what did I do then I started VLC it's also possible and you can stream in VLC stream let's let's quickly check so I did a stream I took the file I uh, don't know if this let's just take quickly uh, one of the, the files and so okay the source next new destination it's gonna be a file that's fine and then test for the film and the video next and then yeah I decided to take this one next then I went away because then it's going to make a stream as you can see it's going to convert the film into another film and with that that file was okay then to try it with to, to cut it actually to to say after so much seconds you can stop my jibber jabber when, when I was trying to uh, find how to close simple screen recorder because it was still recording all the time and with um, control R I think it was the shortcut 
So anyway, finally, um, 33 minutes of recording was then not lost. <laughs> And it was quite a challenge and it's um, amazing, it's amazing that all this is possible on Linux. So I wanted to share you, the, you this with you guys. So basically we started off with uh, this program, Untrunk. Then we went to VLC, we went to stream it and then with that result we cut it with FFmpeg. So wow, thank you Linux. Have fun. <laughs>